Hello guys, and welcome to more Amnesia The Dark Descent. Uh, am I really doing this? I put it off as long as I can. We're about to do like my, one of the least, my least favorite parts of the whole freaking game. Um, but yeah, you'll see. You'll see when I'm only getting there. This part always scares me, at, like, to death every time I watch it. Like, I freak out. So, yeah. Let's just use our pot of acid to watch the stuff pixelate away. And, yeah, refinery. It became impossible to avoid. The commotion in the street begged for his attention. He opened the shutters, the French soldiers opened, as he opened the shutters, the French soldiers opened fire on the two young men fighting back. Their voices were silenced in a haze of gun smoke. Uh, uh, save me! Save me viewers, save me! I don't want to do this part. Like, I'm going to start screaming like a baby. dark in here. Yes, and there's a good reason for it. But you can light the lamp now if you wish. What's the reason? For the darkness, that is. Stay close. Be careful not to stray. What's the reason? Why is it so dark? Pay attention, Dandel. It's important that you keep going straight and make sure not to stray. Okay, I'll keep going straight. Okay, I'm going straight, Alexander. I'm going straight, Alexander. I'm going straight, Alexander. I'm not getting anywhere, Alexander. I'm going straight like you said. Alexander doesn't know what he's talking about. He doesn't know the definition of straight. See, this is not straight. This is curvy. Right to the point yet, but we're nearly there. I figure it's very, I know, very close. Don't look at him. Don't look at him. Okay. So interestingly enough, I'm pretty sure he actually, unless you just make yourself really obvious, he doesn't, he can't hurt you here. I'm pretty sure. you're in real danger until you reach the point that I'm terrified of. We might actually not reach that point if I take long enough in here. I'm really hoping. I'm, I'm probably going to try to draw this out so that we don't reach the point yet. Because I really don't want to play that part. I really don't want to play that part. I'm not looking forward to it at all. Oil! Oil. Give me oil. Thank you. Stop wasting. We keep wasting, however you want to put it. Open the door. Oh my goodness. Laudanum! My best friend ever. Laudanum, 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 laudanum. Door is going open randomly. The first piece of paper. 22nd of June, 1839. <sighs> Daniel's talking. It's more. been more than a month since my last entry. After the event inside the underground chamber in Algeria, Professor Herbert insisted I return to England. Yay. He said he didn't want to risk forfeiting the entire expedition lest I took a turn for the worse. Yay. An excessive decision in retrospect. But I'm glad it turned out that Yay, way. Daniel. I found my journal this morning in the haphazard collection of things brought home from Africa. Next to it, lay the broken stone orb wrapped in cloth. I tried to assemble it, but couldn't. The pieces wouldn't fit together, as if they weren't from the same you object. Just suck at putting together a puzzle, Daniel. Imagined it all? Was there ever a complete you orb? Just never were much of a much of a jigsaw puzzle where you just a jigsaw puzzle put it together person, were you, Daniel? Neither am I. I 
looks like a jigsaw puzzle. I've never finished one except for, you know, the little kid one. I've never done a big one, an adult one. However you want to put it. Lost door or black. Lost black. Indifferent. Oops, I stepped on the stuff. Oh! Anything in here? First, before I go in there. Because there's probably like oil or laudanum in here. Or tinderbox or something. Nothing? Nothing? Oh, tinderbox. Yay! Alright, got that. Is there anything in here? I'm probably going to run out of oil any minute now. <gasps> Paper. Oh, I'm not black. Oh, I'm going crazy. 25th of June, 1839. I feel the need to continue this journal, <sighs> even though it was intended for my journey to Africa. This must be something very must important. Be something important. I just know it. I've taken it upon myself to piece the orb back Agreed. together, but it's, it's been more interested. difficult than one might think. The pieces are behaving strangely. They seem to change color, shape, it's and texture ever so slightly. Yesterday, I took careful measurements and notated any significant markings. Today, I confirmed my suspicions. They were changing. I was terrified and rushed off to see the finest geologist in London, Sir William Smith. I approached the subject with care and we discussed how rocks change form. He told me about the nature of glass, how it eventually collapses on itself, like ice slowly melting over the course really? of centuries. Smith eased my mind a bit, but I can't escape the feeling that these shards have otherworldly properties. Alien orb. I'm not work. Come on, Danny boy. Get the tinderbox. Walk like a drunken fool because that's what you are. But since you know, already playing lies, it really isn't too difficult for the most part. Okay, and back over this way. Make more oil. We don't like you. We don't like you blocking holes. Uh, come on, Daniel. You can ruin my agony. You've already proven this valiantly to me. That you can indeed move in lag. We just get excessive lag this time. Because you're crazy as well as the... Uh, working for a crazy computer. Crazy. 
You can do it, Danny boy. I believe in you. Talking. I don't know why. I've already established that we're finishing this episode now. So, thanks for watching, everyone. Stick around for more of me to the dark descent. You're probably going to hear me shrieking like a baby next episode. Uh, thanks for watching, everyone. They never cease to be amazing. Much love. Pray for me. Bye for now.